Hi, I'm meteorologist Justin Esterly from the Storm Tracker 18 weather team. Thanks for clicking on the video. A heat advisory for you today from 10 a.m. to 9 p.m. for all of our counties in orange. That means heat indices could go from 95 to 100 degrees. We haven't hit 100 with our heat index since 2019, so this would be a relatively rare event as we get into the afternoon. Not only that, there's an excessive heat warning just off to the west. These temperatures are going to feel pretty gross. Temps go into the low 90s, dew points in the mid 70s equals plus 100 in terms of our heat index today. It won't be that way tomorrow, though. A cold front's going to come in and knock temps down for us. It's also going to bring us the chance for some very strong thunderstorms. Now, we are in a level four risk for severe storms, widespread and potentially significant storms at that in that red shaded area. From this, we could be seeing a relatively damaging wind event that comes with all of our severe weather types. We're going to be seeing everything from real large hail at the beginning of this system with the chance for two inches plus in some of those zones. Then it's going to turn into the potential for a very significant straight line wind event. Can't rule out a couple of tornadoes within the mix and embedded inside of this storm as it moves through as well. Overall, a dangerous potential event for us. You need to make sure you have your alerts on and watch for those updates. We'll have them coming through for the majority of your day today. A first round of storms is going to move into the area through lunchtime and then after that, the sooner it comes and goes, the sooner we get recharged in the atmosphere and it's going to lead us to those strong storms. After about 7 o'clock, it looks like these storms are going to start to come through. This little bowing shape means that the very strong straight line winds on the front edge of this system and it pushes into southern Wisconsin by the time we get to 11 or 12 o'clock, which means that we should be free and clear of this as we go throughout our evening and into tomorrow morning. But otherwise, 92 degrees today feels like a, almost 100 with isolated thunderstorms during the middle of the day, stronger storms and potentially widespread damaging storms into our evening before midnight, and then we go into tomorrow on a cooler and quieter note. 85, but not humid, partly cloudy, and that's how we're going to roll as we end July, going into August a little bit cooler still.